Good morning, ITCS. Yes. Yeah, look, I love you guys because I need I need a, a lot of power for this one because you know I I presented that to my colleagues yesterday. They were like, "Damn, this is shocking." So uh, I put the disclaimer: everything is true, but you have to verify for yourself. You know, so that's it. And this hurts. All right, so be ready. So the cloud is amazing, okay? So we are here on the green IT stage. And why I'm saying that? Because it's hosting amazing applications. I'm a fan of science and I love uh, social psychology. Although I'm a PhD in robotics, I love Snapshot, for instance, this application, which is a FOMO science app, you know? And this one, which is Instagram, you know? It's a narcissism, narcissism science uh, platform. Uh, you should try, I mean, I guess, I guess you're all on it already. And, and Facebook, it's a fake news science uh, platform. It's amazing. So this is like composing a lot of the internet traffic and a lot of uh, the cloud usage. And I had the chance, you know, my cap is not just because I'm fan, I work there. And I met uh, the director of, uh, of AI of this uh, cloud over there. So I put some random colors, it's the G cloud. Uh, and he told me that they actually have uh, about 10 tons of electronics coming every day to grow the cloud. 10 towns, okay? It was 8 towns in 2018, so evaluation today is 10. The thing is that if you know about mining for rare metals for those electronics, it's only 2% of the rocks that are actually those rare metals. So you actually need 500 tons, okay? For what? For sending that picture on the social network and say, hey, son, look, that's the mine where, you know, which is hosting your picture. So uh, when you do that by 30 uh, to 15 kilograms uh, bags, that takes a long time, or you just need 16,000 people. That's the thing. But the good thing is that uh, other minings, they have, uh, they use acid, and it's bringing a lot of those metals down to rivers that you know you can't drink, do not drink, but there's a lot of rare metals inside that. You know? And if we can't find enough, it's fine, because Vanda will break the rocks for us, and she's already doing that, okay? So we, as space engineers, we see that from space. We see things moving, okay? We were compelled and we need to do something, a more responsible cloud. So that's what we did also, it's in Europe. So what we do and what we've seen is that Green IT is focused on efficient power, that's nice. Recycling, that's super nice. But then there's a lot we can do just as engineers. Optimizing code, Optimizing software and operating systems so that you have to use less resources for the same purposes. Also, we are GDPR compliant. In 2020, there was a case, nobody knows but the lawyers, and I'm like super dope about that. They actually know about NSA, surveillance programs and those kind of things. And they did a big deal in 2020, if you don't know, that's, that's amazing. And we're compatible to that by design, not like the other, like the G Cloud, where you have to make a standard contract close, if you have a complaint, you are screwed. And green is not expensive, so we're practicing fair price. And to do that, this is our incentives. We're only hosting responsible projects, okay? Because we are faster and cheaper, we want to do that, and we want to use that as an incentive. So the cloud is called Celestical. You have a, you have a QR code there. So do not register because it may change everything. And if you register, you're just making some cloud activity but be responsible about it. So we are parametric, we are on booth S8, S8. I won't tell much more. I'm happy to discuss whatever. And I guess we have time for questions. So, so that's it, yeah. Thank you very much. Any question? Yeah. Go ahead. Yes, so my question is um, what, are the, what are you doing against this uh, uh, rare earth mining? Or I mean, presented it, but I assume you're also using electronics, right? Yeah, the only thing we can do right now is using less of it. Okay, so also you can, uh, and that's the green IT today, it's like using the responsible manufacturer. That's the, the thing we're trying to do. Also, in the beginning, we have a bootstrap where we have to, we're actually recycling servers that people are not using anymore. So we are not like actually putting new stuff there. We're using the tones that are already there, you know, that are not 
uh, used because of contract issues or financial issues, stuff. So they, it's easier to bring new things. It's kind of amazing. So and actually, it's a it's a good price for amazing software uh, hardware. Sorry. Yeah. But the, the the most of the part is like really optimizing the operating system and uh, the the low layer of the cloud, which you know people don't really work on it. They use the open source. Uh, things that are commonly uh, uh, around, so they just push the button and there, there they go. But you have so much to do uh, in the in the back that you can optimize a lot of things. Yeah, good question, Simon. Thank you. <laughs> Another question. Okay, we have a question from Simon. Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah. So you're talking about uh, that you're. Um Optimizing the operating system. So exactly, where did you, where do you get the gains in the operating, in the optimization? Because I think open source yeah. software is big parts. Like a lot of people are working on it. It's yeah. quite good. Yeah. Yeah. We are using open source. I'm a full advocate of open source. We're actually contributing back to open source. Um, and what we're doing, we are we are using Linux, but we're using source Linux. Okay. We're not like just installing a Linux that is, has been compiled by somebody else. We're doing a, a lot of work on optimizing from the kernel to the whole, the whole shell around the kernel. So, and we get the gain is like we are three times faster just by doing that. Then you add up the operating system tweaks, you're even more faster on the network, etc. So that, that's amazing. And in the past, when I was in, my, in, my, in another company, People were testing their software on my on my hardware. We had exactly the same. The system was totally different. I was three times faster than them. So that's that's the thing. Up to five times sometimes, depending on the on the software. So you have amazing powers in IT to do that, and that's uh, that's where that's where we are today. We can we can beat them. Anyone? Another question? Do I have time, uh, Larissa? Or? Yeah. Yeah. Five more minutes. <laughs> we can do a quick poll then. Okay. Who is using a cloud uh, service here in the room? Right. Nice. Yeah. Here. There. Right. Who, who is using one of the apps that they recognized in the beginning? All right. <laughs> so the case, like, I'm sorry. <laughs> Like Flickr, Flickr in 24, they were making uh, uploads of three terabytes a day. Okay, 24, 2004. Uh, today it's totally different. So, how many pictures do you upload? Picture is the file that is the the, the biggest you can generate the most quickly. Okay, on my phone, which is a shitty phone, it's five megabytes. On your phone, it's a dope one. It's 12 maybe. I'm sorry, it's okay, it's okay. You know now, you know now. <laughs> if you don't use apps like Signal where you have peer-to-peer, -peer, then you're using the cloud storage. And storage is the thing that, that grows the fastest. That's why the people work on, you know, the, on the pictures I've seen, which is very sad. Who has a car? <laughs> I know, it's, it's awful. <laughs> yeah, you have a car? You have a question, yeah? Uh, thank you. I should hire you as my business developer. That's uh, so uh, we have we have people who are actually using uh, cloud services, uh, mostly U.S. cloud services, not to name them. Um, I, I have s all the business cases I have; they are being ripped off, you know, what, for the things they are doing online. So usually, when you have a simple web app, small small database, you're giving a good service, etc., you're being ripped off just for the load balancing. You know, half of the price might be the load balancing. What is load balancing is that if you have somebody from the US, they are redirected to another server to get to your, to your application. That's load balancing. So when I work with them, usually uh, the, as we are one third faster, we're also like one third uh, cheaper, uh, one third cheaper, like 70% uh, uh, dis discount somehow from the price they were paying before. And they don't lose in performance. Sometimes they even earn on performance. So our, our typical clients are people who have uh, a small app, they're just starting, they're being totally ripped off, and that's it. 
And on the other side of the spectrum, we have other clients. They are paying a lot already, you know, like it's more like in the 10 case uh, because they are doing analytics and that's, they're also being ripped off on the analytics part, although they don't have much data, you know. I've seen like some, they have like, they pay 7K uh, bill uh, a month and they have 150 gigabytes of data or oh, static. And that's what they play with. So it's uh, ridiculous to me. Does it relate to anyone? No. Who is studying still? It's amazing. It's like, I'm studying. <laughs> it's good. All right. I hope you can work and get experience in the cloud. This is, uh, I mean, this is an amazing uh, experience to, to work in the cloud. You actually see the internet. You know, it's like you see what's happening on the internet. Half of the traffic is robotic, most, most of it. The other half is pornography. And the other half is uh, this guy sending pictures. <laughs> it's 150 person. Yeah, you got me. <laughs> but yeah, talk from that in thirds. But thank you, Larissa. Thank you, everybody. And uh, have a good one. We are in booth S8, as uh, I said on the next slide. And please do, do not hesitate to, to reach out. This is the, the website, uh, the website uh, celestical.net uh, URL. And you have a little survey there. If you're interested, I'll, I'll keep you posted. But thank you so much. Uh, all your support is welcome because uh, we, need, uh, we need to raise awareness on those things. Thank you so much.